president of Volcano Industries. Woo! Yeah. And I am Dr. Volcano, another one. Well, welcoming the audience to a tour of Volcano Industries um, and things go slightly not according to plan. I found it um, quite exciting and you didn't know what was going to happen. If I was giving it 10 out of something, I would give it 10 out of 10. <laughs> There's lots of problem solving and code cracking and uh, challenges that the audience faces and uh, I try and work with them to solve these problems. The show is completely different every time. It really depends on what we get from the audience. So sometimes there's some kid who's just like completely on it and solves everything. And sometimes they have to work really hard and in some ways that's more satisfying. And one of the things the show is about is kind of working through difficulties. How is it different to the other? Tell him, Professor. It's the wrong way round. It's an exciting adventure for the kids racing around chasing killer robots. They have to really work, stretch their brains and try things, be brave and risk making mistakes in order to save the day. I thought it was really good and it was very fun, like the problems because they were all problem solving and thinking of ideas to solve them was fun. It was very good in like you didn't quite know what was coming next. I would say it was mostly about robots, yeah, and it was good because, you know, like in the cinemas, it's just so boring, you just sit there and watch the movie, but here it's just like, you go up, up, down, you'll get your legs moving, <laughs> like exercise. <laughs>